Hi, this is Rod Cuthbert for Viator. I was in Bangkok the other day and took one of our most popular tours there to find out why it always gets reviewed so incredibly well. Um, it's the Rice Barge Tour. It was very cool. On the river, the boats are really the stars. These little tugboats pull barges that are uh, filled with concrete and sand and cement, and they're sometimes strung together six or eight at a time. It's really quite amazing. The tugs are sort of like the little engine that could, but they're nowhere near as colourful as these long tail boats that you see all over the river. They've got car engines on them that have sort of been specially modified. Apparently, they're perfectly low maintenance and there's clearly a whole lot of culture uh, around the guys that run these boats really interesting um, things to see and you see a lot of really interesting river people just going about their daily lives like this woman who lives on one of the barges hanging out her washing these kids diving in the rain here's a guy uh, he's just uh, setting his net for catfish plenty of those in the river this couple have a business selling bananas and I guess hats and I really like this guy. His girlfriend saw me taking the photo and called out to him, and he kept on lathering up, uh, just having a great time. People are really happy out on the river. This guy wasn't quite so happy. I think he's just watched the, uh, the Titanic video. He seems to be channeling Leonardo DiCaprio. Besides the people, there's a lot to see on the river. This is a typical site. We pass so many temples, it's easy to see why people come to Thailand in the first place. It's really quite a spectacular place. The tour boat gets up really close to the temples. You, you think as though you could, you could reach out and touch them. If you're taking pictures, you have to rush from one side of the boat to the other to catch them all. Although, of course, later I realised we'd be coming back down the same river, so I, I really needn't have bothered. Um, I thought the houses on the river were really interesting. Uh, this house is quite modern, but the most interesting ones were like these next two pictures. Uh, take a look at these houses on stilts. They've got so many plants around them. It's Thailand, so if you plant something, it grows straight away. It must be like living in a jungle, yet, yet they're actually right in the middle of one of the world's most popular cities. I spotted a lot of these little spirit houses. The idea is you have one outside your real house, you paint it nicely and keep it shiny, and it attracts the spirits, and they'll choose to live in there rather than in your house, which sounds like a much better idea. Um, the tour is actually on two boats. You start on one of these long open boats and then transfer to one of the old teak rice barges. There's a huge spread on board and while I didn't think Mai Tais and seasonal rice fruits sounded all that exciting, actually I think everyone enjoyed learning about them and there wasn't a skerrick left at the end if that tells you anything. Here's a Spanish speaking guide explaining the fruits to, to her group. I think they'll be looking for mango and sticky rice the next time they go out for tapas. Anyway, I hope that gives you a taste of the Rice Barge Tour. I thought it was terrific, and I'd be very happy to do it again. You can find it and lots of other great Bangkok tours on Viator.com. Thanks for watching.